just seemed like a text thing to me. And yes, she called and was very upset. So Caitlin Bristow has gone on a podcast and talked about her rift with Tasha for the first time. So Caitlin and Tasha hosted two seasons of The Bachelorette together, Katie's and Michelle's. And Tasha was the Bachelorette who ended up with Zach, but they broke up. And since New Year's of this year, Caitlin has been seen with Zach, and it seems like they kind of are dating. So a lot of people thought it was weird that Caitlyn would date Tasha's ex because they were coworkers, were they friends? But what Caitlyn said on this podcast is that her and Tasha were never really friends, and she knew that Tasha never really liked her. So when Caitlyn started dating Zach, she texted Tasha, and Tasha called her very upset and says, "I always knew you were a bad person, and this just confirms it." Oof. If you look at the clips of that podcast on the creators page that I stitched, I am shocked that Caitlyn is just like saying all for the first time because it seems like she's been holding this in for a really long time. I want to listen to the full podcast before forming an opinion, but I do understand why Tasha would be bothered that she's dating Zach, but I also understand why she should be unbothered. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Okay, listen to the full episode of Caitlyn Bristow on the You Up podcast, and here are the spark notes. This podcast is already taking the internet by storm because she talked about Tasha for the first time. But she also talked about some other things like how she was the first person to hit a million followers in the franchise. And how her ex, Sean Booth, probably hates that he still comes up in her interviews. And that she did Jason a favor breaking up with him because now he found happiness and they just weren't aligned. But she also talked about how Zach Clark DM'd her and they started talking. And they were talking for a little bit before she decided to text Tasha and just let her know. She says she really doesn't think Tasha ever liked her and they really weren't friends. It was more of a work situation, but she still wanted to give her the heads up. Tasha waited like a day to respond to her and she actually just called her. And when Tasha called her, she said, I always knew you were a bad person and this just confirms it. Caitlyn was pretty taken aback by how harsh Tasha spoke to her on the phone. That Caitlyn joked about sending Tasha a picture of her being intimate with Zach. She talks a lot about keeping mutual friends after a breakup and how she's known for ranting and going off the rails. So she actually had compassion if Tasha was reaching out and lashing out because Tasha can't talk to Zach, so she might take out that energy on Caitlyn. She said her and Tasha went to two weddings together and they actually just ignored each other and it felt mature and cordial. And that if Tasha ever reached out to her to apologize for speaking to her on the phone that way, she would be like, hey, no worries, let's just get a drink and move on. She didn't use Tasha's name by name and she didn't use Zach's name by name. So it was just like too obvious for us to figure out who she was talking about. Tasha has never talked about this situation online before. She never talks about Bachelor Nation online. So it'll be interesting if Tasha ever decides to tell her side of the story, hopefully in a memoir tell all book.